I've been shopping the Nordstrom anniversary sale for at least the last probably 10 years. Some years it's a really great sale and some years it's not. In that time I've also learned what is really worth buying at the sale and what is not. Part of the reason I love shopping in store is when I get to be surprised by things and I was very much surprised by this sweater. It wasn't something that I even had on my wish list or to try on list but when I saw it in store I thought you know that's very cute. It's cropped and a little boxy. This is actually a small, and um, don't mind my wires, y'all. I'm gonna try to keep them from popping out, but you know how we roll around here. Normally I would size up in sweaters and get, you know, like a medium or something, but I stuck with a small for this one because of the kind of fit it's supposed to have. But I really like the more boxy and kind of cropped fit of this one because I'm often wearing things now with like high-waisted pants, high-waisted jeans. And so I don't want big long sweaters that are hard to tuck in. I know not everybody is into the crop trend, but I do actually find the sweaters to be more wearable, a lot of shirts and stuff more wearable when they're cropped because you don't have as much fabric to stuff and try to hide. I got it in sort of this heathered oatmeal color. It's thick, but not too thick. It's very soft, not at all itchy. These pants were ones that I just grabbed in store to try on. Again, I did not expect to like these. I tried these on for y'all, basically, for so that I could kind of review them for people and let you know. I love them. They are like a wide leg, very stretchy. The fabric is very stretchy high-waisted, um, almost like sailor style pants. You know, they don't have any pockets in the back. So you probably, which I am not, but you probably want to wear some smoothing underwear with these. I would recommend unless you're just blessed with a smooth, high and tight booty. But for the rest of us, smoothing underwear is definitely going to want to be something that you wear with these. Come in a number of different colors. I didn't expect to love them as much as I do. Okay, so one of the other tops that I wanted to show you is this halogen paperweight tee. These come in a bunch of different colors. They are really great uh, layering pieces. It's very thin. Um, you can tuck them or if you were to wear it like it's full length, that's what it looks like. It's very thin but very very soft which makes it perfect again for layering with sweaters if you've got like just a slightly itchy sweater or something like that. Um, I love being able to layer or to layer with vests and there are a ton of of great vests in the sale this year that I'm going to show you. So I just wanted to point out and show you this layering tee. There are plenty in stock. They come in a wide variety of sizes and colors. So these jeans are the rag and bone mid rise ankle straight jeans. I really like these. They are soft. They're a little stretchy. They're not like completely stiff. There's a little stretch to them. Uh, they fit very true to size, at least for me. I think uh, the pocket placement on the butt is nice uh, to help kind of, you know, make your booty look a little bit better. They're flattering on the rear end anyways. It's not going to make things any worse is all I'm saying. I think they're flattering on the booty. They fit pretty true to size. There's a, a little stretch, a little give to them. There's no destruction or holes or anything like that in them. They're just a nice, good, fairly dark wash, medium to dark wash denim. And I really, really liked these. They'll be great when I wear like little ankle booties and stuff in the fall. Speaking of layering this vest, I really, really like the whole vest trend this fall. Um, I think it's very wearable, very easy to wear. It has a very kind of classy feel, even if you were to wear them, like I got a black tank or a black vest that I would wear more like a tank top. This is really fun to just wear with a denim. Um, you could of course like wear it with dress pants, but I think the idea here, at least for me, is to make it more casual, make it a little more fun, a little bit more relaxed. This particular vest I really liked because as my mother pointed out, it has like a little blue stripe through it, which I think kind of helps it pair really well with denim. You could put a really great belt with this. Just something that's easy to dress up, dress down. I'm all about like throwing together an outfit that's very easy. And I just think this is so fun and could totally be, again, dressed up with some jewelry belts, the kind of shoes you wear or dress down with sneakers. Uh, lots of different ways to wear a vest like this. All right, so this is maybe one of my favorite things from the sale. This is a free people sweater. Um, I do have the turtleneck very tucked in. It's a big kind of loose cowl neck. You can tuck it in the front if you want. They run big, okay? So you're gonna wanna size down. This is a small. The sleeves are tight right here, but then it goes into like a bat wing. So it just has that kind of very movable, comfy feel to it, which I love. And I have to tell you, it's part of the reason I like to go in store because I'm not sure that I would have even purchased this sweater this year 
or picked this color. And that was it. When I saw the color in store, I was like, man, I really love that. And I don't own a sweater in that color or anything that looks like that. So like I said, you can tuck it in. Um, it's very oversized. You can totally just leave it untucked and wear it big and open. Got a few different pairs of shoes in the sale that I think will pair really well with this because you can totally dress it up or down, wear it with sneakers to kind of dress it down or you could wear it with uh, like some little ankle booties, some uh, low heel boots or something that would be a little bit more dressed up with this. One of my very favorite things, again, I, I'm always on the hunt for good free people stuff, and this did not disappoint. All right, so this flannel is from a brand called BDG, and I buy one of these flannels in the sale pretty much every single year because they are so soft. I just, I can't find the words to tell you how soft this thing is. It's just so soft and comfortable. They're very uh, oversized. This is a medium and you can see it kind of goes quite far down. If I untuck it, it's nice and big and loose. It's a little bit on the wide side, if you will. I kind of wish I would have gotten a small just because I do typically uh, tuck my flannels or tuck my shirts like this now more than I wear them like completely down and oversized over leggings. I usually just wear stuff like this with jeans more often these days, but I love this. I highly recommend it. They're in the description box. I'll put a star next to my sort of like, if you have to pick just one or two things, these are the things that I recommend. So you can bet your booty that my free people sweater and this flannel will definitely be on that list of like, if I could only buy one or two things, these would be definitely it. All right, so like I mentioned, there are a lot of really fun vests in this year's sale. This particular vest comes in black and in a very vibrant, bright kind of orangey red. There are lots of ways to wear this. You could pair it with a skirt, pair it with denim, pair it with corduroys or other types of pants. Lots of different ways that you could wear this. You don't have to wear it by itself. You could totally wear it over something. I just think it's really fun for fall. Very versatile piece that you can absolutely keep and wear in your wardrobe for years to come. Um, it's not something that you can't find ways to style. Like I said, styling it up, down, making it a little bit more trendy or a little more classic. It's just such an easy piece to wear and style in all of the different kind of style types, if you will. All right, let me just tell you that there are a number of denim jackets in the sale this year. It's one of those that never really goes out of style, but there's a ton of denim. Denim's just very on trend right now. So there's lots of denim dresses and vests and jumpers and jackets. This is the AG jacket. I also ordered the Levi's denim jacket so that I could compare and contrast. Um, I don't have it yet, it hasn't arrived yet. So if you wanna see that comparison, you can always go follow me over on LTK. I do a lot more in depth, cause as you know, with the Nordstrom sale, not everything is um, available in store. So you have to order. So I will have other things arriving that I'll be you know, showing and comparing and stuff. So you can follow me on Instagram or on the LTK app if you want more detailed information. But this, Le or this AG denim jacket is just the perfect denim jacket. Okay, if you need one, this is, perfect. The fit of it, I'm wearing a small, it's oversized, but not so oversized that it's like weird. And it's got a little bit of stretch to it, but not too much. Just like I said, it's kind of the Goldilocks of, of denim jackets, if you will, because it's just got enough stretch to make it, my dog just bumped the tripod. It's got enough stretch to make it very comfortable and easy to wear, but not so much stretch that it starts to look kind of like cheesy or cheap. Uh, if you wanna go for the Canadian tuxedo and go head to toe denim, you can. Again, easy to throw on with skirts, floral skirts, or I'm wearing it with these velvet pants. You could wear it with corduroys. So many different ways that you could wear this jacket. It's an investment piece for your closet, but one that you could have for the rest of your adult life. A good denim jacket can sit in your closet for the rest of your life till you're a granny and you're like, maybe you're a cool granny and you still wear your denim jacket. I don't know, but you can wear it for a really, really long time. So definitely a piece that I would highly recommend if it's something that you want or need for your wardrobe. All right, next up is this jacket. I adore this. It is just such a beautiful shade of navy, one that you don't see often and one that is really a true navy. A lot of times you see, they'll, like, they'll tell you something's navy and you're like, hmm, from a distance, I can't really tell, is that black or navy? Uh, and then you get up closer, like, oh, okay, it's navy. I just love that this is a navy jacket and you can tell, there's no question. Um, it's not too bright blue, but it just has such like beautiful depth to it. The fabric is so soft. 
Um, it's got, you know, like a little collar here. You can cinch up the sides with your little ties here to make it kind of fit tighter around the waist. You've got your pockets, lots of pockets in this jacket because of the, the style of jacket it is. Again, like kind of hits just at your waist. I'm wearing a small in this. It's around $50. I just think it's a fabulous deal. If you need a jacket for fall, this is the perfect like lightweight jacket to get you through um, until you start needing to wear your, your bigger, heavier coats. This is just, it's perfect. I really, really adore this. It's definitely one of my top five items, pieces from the sale. All right, so this is the Topshop cropped cardigan sweater. Uh, again, this comes in like two different colors, I believe. This more brown, sort of heathered type look, and then one that's also gray, I believe. I am wearing it in a small, I would say it's like a one to two on the itch scale of zero to 10. Zero being not itchy at all, 10 being don't come near me with that thing. This would be like a one or a two, okay? Um, I can feel that the fabric is there, but it doesn't actually irritate my skin. So I just wanna give you a heads up there. Um, you could wear this like a shirt. Again, you could totally just button it and wear it like a shirt. For me, there's a little too much boob and belly there for me to wear it completely like a shirt. I would need to put something under it, some kind of like maybe sports bra or bodysuit would be great under this, some kind of bodysuit. Goes great with denim, you could wear it with skirts. So many different ways that you could wear this. A great kind of staple piece for fall and winter and it's on the more affordable end in terms of the Nordstrom sale. So definitely something that I recommend and that I really liked. Not something I thought I was actually gonna buy, but again, I was kind of surprised when I tried things on. A lot of things that I thought I was gonna love and buy, I didn't. And I ended up swapping them out for other things like this that I didn't expect to buy but really really liked all right i wanted to show you some shoes really quickly because there are a few pairs in the sale that i really love are these converse that are leather i already love converse but make them leather so they're wipeable and washable and i am there a hundred percent then i got the gazelle shoes from adidas these are sold out everywhere all the time especially in like the good colors and i loved this kind of brown taupey shade it was very much like my style so i was glad i was able to snag a pair of those and then, of course, slippers because, well, I am the slipper queen and these Ugg slippers are so fabulous. They're kind of like putting a little Muppet right on your foot. They come in a few different colors and actually two different textures as well. But I loved these so much and I love the hard soles so that if I do wander outside in them, it's OK. I also got these very like kitten heel but pointed toe Dolce Vita, I believe, Dolce Vita boots. I really like that they have the ankle that's tight because that looks great with cropped pants. Then I grabbed a couple hats. I haven't gotten any kind of new like fashion type hat in many years. And I saw these and I just thought, man, I really like those. And I can see them like the black one with a black sweater and black boots would look great. Uh, the tan one, again, could look good with so many different things and they were fairly affordable. So I decided to get both colors. There are some things that I repurchase in the sale pretty much every year uh, because they're products that I use up and love. So things like the Donna Karen Cashmere Mist Deodorant, I absolutely love this. I purchased the three pack in the sale every year. This product I started purchasing probably two years ago and I love it. And I usually still have some left by the time the sale comes back around. So these two things definitely last me a year. You can use such a little amount of this. It goes such a long way. So you're getting the actual shower oil bottle with the pump and then this is your refill. I typically do also get some kind of brow kit. I alternate what stuff I use for my brows. I do really like the Anastasia Soft Brown. This is a set that comes with the Brow Wiz, Brow Definer, and the Clear Brow Gel. And there's also the Benefit Brow Set in the sale, which is, I believe, only like $22. And you get, I think, three of the Benefit Brow products in that one. I gotta open this because I gotta put something on my lips. They're so dry right now from talking so much. I decided to try this. I saw it and I was very intrigued by it. This is the Estee Lauder Lip Rescue. So it comes with a full size of this lip rescue like balm and gloss that apparently don't have any like real color to them. Jesse, dog opened my door. That feels nice. I can tell you that. It definitely feels nice. It feels really nice and it's basically like clear, I guess you would say. So your your lips but better. If I can get the dang gloss out. Ah! Then there's like the gloss, similar, but more glossy, less balmy. I really like that set. This would be a great set to grab and gift for Christmas because it is so just like neutral. You don't have to pick a color for somebody or know what colored lipstick they like wearing. So that would make a great gift as well. There's also the MAC lip set. This comes with the 
uh, Velvet Teddy 2.0 lipstick gloss. I don't remember the shade of the gloss. The gloss is in the color Spite and then the lip pencil in the color Spice. So good like wearable colors for almost everybody. Good just kind of neutrally pink colors. And then I also wanted to try this duo because I have the uh, Kapari Skin Lotion. I've had it before and you can see I've already busted into this and let me just tell you, oh my goodness. Okay, so you get this bottle of like body oil. I don't know if you can see that it's like, it's like raised the logo on it. It's a really beautiful bottle. Um, it's called Golden Aura Body Oil with 24 karat gold and hyaluronic acid. You shake it to kind of mix in the gold flakes in there and then it makes your skin so shiny and luminous but not glittery. That's the thing, okay? I'm, I'm past the age of glitter. So if you're past the age of glitter but you want a really like sun-kissed kind of look, this stuff is beautiful. It smells amazing and feels great. And then you get this giant Ultra Restore Body Butter. That is a huge body butter, uh, 12 fluid ounces. It smells amazing too. And I really like their body butter that I have like in the pot. So I figured this would be uh, probably pretty good too and it did not disappoint. So this set is one that I think is uh, definitely worth snagging in the sale. So I grabbed a few other beauty things. I'll probably share a little bit more about those on Instagram or LTK since they're just like a little more beauty product type focus. It's a great time to stock up on products that you would normally buy um, or to get a really good deal on something that you've really wanted to try. There's also a lot of great value sets. The T3 curling iron set with the swappable wands, you get like three different sizes. It's something I purchased about a year or so ago and I really, really love it. That's definitely something I think is worth purchasing if it's been on your wish list. I will also often, if I need them, add some more of my very favorite bras, the Notori bras are in the sale and they are deeply discounted from their normal price. So I do usually grab a bra or two in the sale to add a few more colors to my collection because they are kind of pricey bras. So I added a pink and like a chocolate brown color this year. I love these bras. I love the fit. They're so soft. They hold up, they fit so well. They're one of my favorite pieces. 